posted February 22, 2019 21 hours 52 minutes and 26 seconds An Australian woman has died in an avalanche in the Canadian ski resort of Whistler Blackcomb. Key points, the Whistler Blackcomb Ski Resort was hit by a Class 1 avalanche and the woman was transported to a local hospital, where she died. Canadian officials have launched an investigation into the death of 42-year-old from New South Wales died after snowboarding through a permanently closed area above the advanced ski run, Lakeside Bowl. On Thursday, local time, the resort confirmed there was a Class 1 avalanche and that the woman was transported to the Whistler Health Care Centre, where she died. A 36-year-old man who was snowboarding with the woman survived the avalanche. Canadian authorities are investigating the death, which Avalanche Canada said occurred on a steep, rocky, south-facing slope near Whistler. On the same day, it issued a warning for recreational background to users south of where the accident happened, including videos showing how perilous the conditions can be. Human-triggered avalanches will be likely over the weekend, especially on steeper terrain, the statement said. The clearing skies and fresh snow will be very inviting, but we are urging backcountry users to be extra cautious during this period. Avalanche Canada is warning backcountry users in the region covered by this warning to use safe travel techniques and avoid avalanche terrain. Everyone in a backcountry party needs the essential rescue gear, transceiver, probe and shovel, and know how to use it. The Department of Foreign Affairs and Trade said it was providing consular assistance to the victim's family. A spokesman said, owing to our privacy obligations, we are unable to provide further comment. Topics, avalanche, disasters and accidents, Canada, 